Hello everyone, it's Gomrath with Gomrath Games, and today I'm going to be bringing you a guide to beat Zorvask, the satyr, out in Valsurad with an entirely flying type team. Now this is quite the challenge. So in your first slot, I'm going to recommend a Bone Dragon Hatchling with Thrash, Hawkeye, and Liftoff. The reason for Hawkeye is you can get some nice crits on Liftoff, like I did in this particular video. In your second slot, a Blazing Firehawk with Scorched Earth, Burn, and Cauterize. I don't end up using Cauterize, but the Scorched Earth Burn combo is pretty strong versus his second pet. And then in your, finally in your final slot, you want an Azure Crane Chick with um, Cleansing Rain and Surge to fight his elemental pet in the end uh because that elemental pet is actually really challenging it can consume corpse twice and you just got to kill it really quick and it also has an attack that's very strong versus flying types that does 555 damage even when it doesn't crit so he's pretty dangerous now right off the bat here i'm going to do hawkeye and lift off because i'm faster than the imp and i know i'm going to be able to dodge his nether gate he always uses it his second turn and i get lucky and i get a, a decent size crit now i may have been better off if i used the power power breed of the dragon bone but i just thought a hmm, little bit more health maybe uh just longer survivability and i may have been able to kill him that round he survived with 16 health right there so kind of a pain in the butt but whatever now, on his second pet here that comes out, he's got two moves that are really strong versus flying. And so I figure, okay, I'm just going to get as much damage in as I can before I die. And does 600 damage to me. Then he just hits me with acidic goo, and I get one more hit in before he kills me. Now, the Firehawk, uh, he has a weather effect. And this was something I hadn't anticipated versus the last pet. But weather effects don't affect elemental types. That's their uh, breed passive, and it only really helps with this first guy. So I think I'm able to kill him right here, yeah, with my burn. And so he's not able to hit me really hard with expunge. But now my burn ability in that first slot, or the deep burn, it only does 200 and something damage because he's an elemental type and if i use cauterize it won't give me a big heal because it counts the last hit i took as the scorched earth damage so anyway i'm not able to do very much on this first guy i get one hit in and then i get switched into my azure crank chick now you get this from just looting nests out in the timeless isles and it's definitely a good pet to have i would highly recommend it uh, the reason I used Cleansing Rain right there instead of using it as a heal was I just wanted to get rid of the stupid uh, burn, Scorched Earth, because it was only hurting me, it was not hurting him. Now, I know he's going to use Consume Corpse this turn, and it brings him up to half health. And I know he's also going to use Nightmare versus me, and so if Nightmare crits, it would have been a game over. But gratefully, it doesn't crit, and I'm able to finish him off with Surge. Now... This is how I beat Zorvask uh, with an entirely flying type team. If you found this guide helpful, a like rating is always appreciated. And let me know below if there's any questions you have or any other tamers you want me to cover. I'm going to be working on getting guides for every tamer with every possible combo. Anyway, you have a great day and take care.